Today, we will talk about vision boards and how should your vision board be for holistic success in life, which means creating vision board for all the four areas of your life, that is health, relationship, career, and money. Hello, welcome back to another video. My name is Vaiba Chunchure. I'm a law of attraction coach and I help people expand their consciousness. Also, I'm an author of my book called My Two-Year-Old Teacher. All right, let me tell you, by the end of this video, you will have a clear understanding of how vision boards work and how can you create vision boards that works for you. And I will show you step by step. I will show you, in fact, you know, my personal vision boards that I have created for myself in each area of my life. Would you like to see them? Yes? So, so watch the video till the end and let's get started. Okay, so did you know that there are three types of learners in this world? There are three types by which a person can learn and remember. And those three types are visual, auditory and kinesthetic. Usually referred as VAK, visually audit, visual, auditory and kinesthetic, which means Every human being can learn and absorb information and remember things in memory through these three mediums. Number one, visuals. So visual learners absorb information by sight, which means, you know, when they see information in the form of a picture, it is easy for them to remember and absorb the things and grasp the things very easily. Now, those are the kinds of people who are called as visual learners. In fact, you know, what they do is they see pictures, you know, they remember things in the form of pictures or videos. That's one. Two, auditory. So auditory learners absorb information by hearing it. So any verbal instruction given to them straight goes into their head and they follow them very easily. So basically, you know, listening is the medium for them to absorb any piece of information at a faster rate. Three, then comes these kinesthetic learners. So this style of learning requires touch, which involves, you know, physical activity rather than listening or, you know, lecture or looking at visual presentation. So, you know, these type of uh, learners by, you know, they, they learn by actually trying it out by themselves. The best example of kinesthetic learning would be, you know, say when a child is, you know, learning to ride a bike or when someone wants to learn swimming. So you can't learn by watching a video or listening to, you know, a lecture, right? You have to jump into the water. Now that's kinesthetic. Now, why am I telling you all these mediums of remembering things that remain in your conscious and subconscious mind? Before I tell you that, I would like to tell you one more thing. Out of those three types, visual, auditory and kinesthetic, number one, which I told you, visual. Visual is the most powerful medium of learning and remembering things. Did you know that of all the information that a brain receives, 90% is, is a visual information that remains in here in comparison to text or audio. And you know, visual content or any visual data is processed 60,000 times faster compared to text or audio. In fact, did you know 40% of our total nerve fibers are connected to our retina? That's right. Which means the human brain can understand a visual scene in one tenth of a second. Right? These are mind-boggling numbers, right? Don't you think? Okay, I'll give you an example. If I ask you to experience a story, say it's a story of a Mahabharata or a Ramayana or any mythological story or any story for that matter. And I will give you a choice of going through the story through two mediums. Option one, I will ask you, you know, uh, option number one, I'll ask you to read a story from a book. Or option number two, I'll ask you to experience the same story through a movie or a TV show. Now, which one would you choose? I would choose option number two, right? I mean, it's mostly option number two. 95% of them would choose option number two. Why? Because learning or experiencing stories in the form of visuals, that is pictures or videos is more entertaining and easier to grasp and understand anything. So anything in the form of pictures remains in our brains for the longest time ever compared to text or audio. Now, example. Look at this picture. I found this picture on the internet. Now, this is a very good example, you know, that uh, represents how our eyes can easily identify something that is, you know, very uncommon and that is something very unusual, which is, you know, highlighted. Now, look at this picture number one. 
if you look at the picture number one so there are you know so many dashes out there but there is one just one square now there is a change in the shape just check how your eye, eye, eyes were able to quickly grasp it right now look at picture number two there are so many dots out there but just there is a bigger size of a dot in between and your eyes were able to just quickly go there and identify that right cool look at picture number three now these are you know all similar dots of the same sizes but again there is color change in one of the dots and your eyes were able to catch it this fast right now look at picture number four all same dashes but just there is a small change in the you know orientation of the dash and your eyes were able to catch grasp it so easily right now now the same thing right if i tell you verbally or if i ask you to read it and you know identify the variation in in, in these pictures in the form of instruction right it won't be as quick and as easy as the pictures in the visual form isn't it now that's the power of information in the form of visuals so when i learned about the vision board for the first time in 2018 yes i wanted to try having you know a vision board for myself i was so inspired by the movie the secret do you know what i did i immediately went out you know cut out a picture of a car that i wanted to buy it was a s cross in a metallic gray color <clears throat> i had it color printed on a paper in two sizes one was a bigger one and one was a smaller one the bigger one was like you know this big it was literally like this big and the smaller one was this small so the bigger picture i had three copies of it so one i pasted in the bedroom on one of the walls which would, and you know uh, another i pasted inside of a cupboard where i keep my clothes and the third copy i put it on the fridge i just put it on the fridge and they were all the bigger sizes and the smaller picture which was just this size that it could fit into my wallet and i kept that in my wallet see i did not have many visions back then i just wanted to try something you know so i just had one vision for just one goal a very materialistic goal though but that was my goal and i visioned having it you know even before i even before it materialized it right and in the span of 4 months or even less than 4 months i can say after i put that on my wall and fridge and the wallet in less than 4 months on 16th of august 2018 i walked out of the car showroom with a brand new s cross and it was the same metallic gray color that i had it in my vision board so not just that after i had another goal for you know another desire and this is absolute magic you know please listen to this after i attracted a car i thought let me try something else and back then i was using an apple phone and i am fond of apple products so so i just love all the apple products so i wanted to have an apple watch for myself so i removed the picture of the car from my wallet and replaced it with a picture of an apple watch and not just that i also put it as a wallpaper as a background on my laptop right as a laptop wallpaper and guess what it was my birthday the same year and my wife gifted me an apple watch yes you see this is the same watch i'm still wearing it and it works like crazy even today i wear it every day and i wear it when i'm working out when i go for a run i just wear it because this tracks everything perfectly now this is the power of having goals in the visual forms because see when something is in visual visual form our brains have the tendency to grasp visual informations much faster quicker and effortlessly and it remains in our brains you know as a long term memory right in fact according to one of the research when any information in the form of words or texts our brain can retain only 7 bits of information where bits is basically a binary digit in computer language which represents the storage of the capacity of information so our brain when something is it in in the form of text form right it can retain only 7 bits which is a short term memory whereas any information passed to our brain in the form of visuals or images or videos it straight goes into our long term memory kit and you know the best part that it you know the best part is anything that goes into our long term memory kit it can it cannot be easily removed or you know cannot be easily erased it in other words it's for good i would say example think of something from your childhood which is in your memory as fresh as it was yesterday i'm sure every one of you watching this video will have some memories from your childhood right no matter how old you are you will have some memory as clear as a movie running in your mind right now right 
So please tell me what what memory you have from you have you from your childhood that you remember you know very very clearly very very vividly. You just put that in the comment box. I would really love to you know read those memories from your childhood. Yeah, cool. But the question is, why only a few of these memories are so fresh in here? Why not all the memories? Because emotions and visual informations are processed in the same part of the brain. You see, there is a link between you know what you see and how you feel, and uh, these two things are what we call as memories. I repeat, what you see and how you feel, these two things is what we call as memories. hence some images to which you know to which we are emotionally connected create a very strong impression in our mind in here and that becomes a long term memory which doesn't fade easily even after a long time are we good cool right now now that we know how visuals work and why visuals are powerful compared to text or any other format let's move on to the next important part which is how should the vision board be or how should we create a vision board all right see you you can go on google or just go on youtube and you know just search for vision board you will have plenty of videos with varieties of different types of vision boards people created for themselves in fact on google while well, while i was searching there are also you know uh, some ready made templates available too you just need to write your goals and fill in the blanks there it is as simple as that So what I'm trying to say is don't stress about don't stress yourself too much on making a perfect vision board because you know what personally what I feel there is nothing called as a perfect vision board every vision board is a perfect vision board as long as your goals in the form of pictures are right in front of your sight most of the time now that makes any vision board a perfect vision board right that's my understanding and I believe it see i'll show you my vision board it's pretty simple i don't have a vision board kind of a thing you know i just created my own vision board in a ppt in a powerpoint mat and i selected a few pictures from google that are closest to my goals and i pasted there but see i invested close to 4 hours maybe more than 4 hours i remember creating my vision board because see that's a serious stuff i can't do a copy paste job here i can't find You know, somebody's goals and put it on my vision board. No, I thought through it. I made a list of short-term and long-term goals: my dream house, my car, my lavish holidays, family, etc. See, everyone has their own goals and visions, so it can't be just copy-pasted. And you know what? I truly enjoyed the process while I was creating my vision board. I was feeling happy, you know, while I was creating creating my vision board, like I was painting my own future. so i made sure that i spent some time create it carefully but here is the thing my vision board is a combination of visuals and text because see now visuals are pictures form of my goal and you know and i thought of having affirmations to my vision board because see affirmations are something that i affirm to myself that i want it in my life right that i want to attract in my life so combining affirmations with visuals and visuals basically images can make a vision board of a super powerful vision board see i have not only put a picture of my dream house my next car a picture about you know how i want to look in terms of my body picture of my book and a lot many but i have also combined them with affirmations like i have 100% was to complete house of my own right which is completely owned by me and that's the affirmation i have put i have also put i have athletic body I have also put affirmations like I'm financially free. I have 100,000 plus subscriber on YouTube and I have put a picture next to it about my book and my next you know ne- next to the book picture I have put an affirmation that it's a national best seller book with a five star rating on Amazon. So you see pictures plus affirmations equal to a powerful vision board. That's how I have created my vision board. Now there are again two advantages of creating vision board in this form advantage number 1 see you can be creative and have all your goals of your vision on your vision board because not all the goals will have images example say i want to have an excellent immune system 
you will not find a relevant picture of a strong immune system right on google or anywhere right so you can write your goal in the form of affirmation and it works like a vision right advantage number 2 because you will be looking at your picture uh, looking at your pictures you know and your affirmations every single day your mind will be actually reading it subconsciously and it gets registered and printed in your subconscious mind so what do you do you wake up in the morning and you just look at your vision board what happens so what happens is you are both reading and envisioning your goals isn't it so pictures and affirmations work like magic trust me having an affirmation on a vision board is a great thing right so go ahead and create your vision board now comes the most important part and that is to create a vision board for all the areas of your life all the areas health relationship career and money see i have purposefully put health in the first place because everything starts with a good health and that is so freaking true right only if you have a good health you will enjoy all the benefits of life right followed by relationship followed by career and money see holistic success is the way of life i truly believe that one should be abundantly healthy and wealthy in all the four areas of life otherwise what's the point say you have enough money and you know you can buy all the expensive stuff but you are suffering from blood sugar and doctor have advised you not to eat sugar at all cut down the sweets the sweetness in your life is gone my dear friend or say you have health and wealth both you can buy anything but your own family disowns you your parents don't like you children hate you you have no one to share your happiness with what's the point of course you may attract you know some people who might give you temporary happiness till you have the money again but it is only your family that will truly be happy in your success right so are you getting my point so when i say holistic success that means having a successful life in all the areas of your life <clears throat> only then you'll be happy and content right so create a vision board in all the areas of your life over and above that again i have made a special vision board for myself that's for money but i made sure that i have covered all the four areas before i create the other vision boards also i have multiple vision boards okay okay now listen to me very carefully pay attention to this over and above everything i have shared with you so far with respect to the vision board here comes the most important and the top secret now that's a tip tip to make your vision board work for you and if you use this tip in your life all the visions of your life no matter how big or small how easy or difficult not just a car you can also you know attract a private jet in your life if that is your goal would you like to know that tip type in yes in the comment box all right now that is called as action frequency see have me action action frequency in your goals now what do i mean by having action frequency see if my vision board is you know of a picture of a man with a you know perfect body and abs or maybe your vision board has a woman so your vision board has a picture of a lady in a perfect shape looking gorgeous in a beautiful dress while you are eating habits a bad you eat junk drink all sort of sugar drinks you don't work out you don't take care of yourself you don't sleep well sorry my dear friend no matter how beautiful your vision board is it is not going to work and i promise you that if your vision board has a picture of a nice big house whereas you are not working towards your money making skills at all no matter what is your vision board you will never attract that dream house of yours see in fact you will never be able to afford that house you need to have a action frequency in your routine you have to work towards your goals you know you can't dream of having a six pack abs and get up late and finish your work and go back home and have a nice five course meal watch netflix and chill no your action frequency should be getting up 2 hours earlier and move your ass work out go for a walk go for a run do push ups sit ups start with baby steps and progress a little bit in in your regime every single day every week only then the universe will help you get what you always wanted 
it will open up doors of opportunities to fast track your goals and achieve them effortlessly see not just that not just a vision board anything in your life or even the law of attraction for that matter works on this principle only if the universe sees that you are working hard your universe will be like hey this person seems to be working hard let me help him you know achieve his goals let me let me help him achieve what he wants in his life or in her life see when i wanted to buy a car of course i put up a picture of a car in my vision board but parallelly i worked for it and i started saving some money and that was my action frequency now because i was trying to work towards my goal of buying an s cross car the universe made it possible in less than 4 months for me to manifest my exact metallic gray color s cross car right so the bottom line show the universe that you are worth the goal that you have on your vision board and see the magic happen every single day in your life perfect now how many of you want to see my vision board i will show you my vision board personally the vision board that i have personally created for myself where i have captured my both short term and long, long and long term goals are you ready here it is so i'll just take you straight inside there and all right so starting with this so do you, do you do you see my uh, vision board in terms of my health you see the picture of a person here now that's the that's the body that i would like to really attract and i have put again an action frequency wala vision board where a person is doing push ups right now look at this now in my health vision board i have mentioned you know universe thank you so much i'm able to maintain my perfect body health that's one then again i have mentioned universe thank you that i have i achieved my ideal body weight of 70 kg by the way i'm just two or three kgs away from you know uh, hitting a target of 70 kgs with a broad chest muscle shoulders and arms you know with flat flat stomach and strong abs now that's my vision and see look at the affirmations i have put i love exercising and i love eating healthy food right and i have mentioned yes i love taking care of my health now these are the affirmations that i have put and i am also a massive action taker now that's the vision board in terms of my health right coming to the second part that is my relationship i have mentioned my relationship standards in my vision board okay so i have you 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 see the picture there of my family that's me my daughter and my wife right and you know uh, i have again a picture of you know a, a nice happy couple there holding each other's hand and my affirmation says you know i have an excellent relationship with myself and love spending time with myself you now those are my affirmations i have also mentioned you know my relationship with my parents and all my family members are perfect and i love spending time with them and that's one of my vision again again i have mentioned i have an extraordinary relationship with piku piku i mean my wife's name is priyanka uh, i call her piku and we have a lot of love respect and intimacy in our relationship now that's again you know one of the affirmations and you know just read those boxes there it is very easy for anyone to relate with me and it is very easy for me to relate with anyone this is one of those you know uh, standards that i would really want to have in when it comes to relationship with with my family or with anybody outside now this is my relationship now here comes the career standards look at that career standards i have put a picture of uh, a road which is you know leading to success a path that is leading to success and there's a graph where a person is climbing high and he's a successful person right now these are the visual representation of how i want my career to be right and again i have put a small uh, picture which says i am unstoppable now look at the affirmations right i am like you know thank you universe for the job i am doing you know thank you so much for the wonderful business i have that's one and i have mentioned i have i am uh, i love my work and i add 10 times value for my work i have also mentioned i am a problem solver and i am just unstoppable now look at those small you know boxes where i have mentioned you know uh, two standards which says i create work satisfaction every single day and have unshakable belief in myself i think these two are the principles when it comes to have a happy and a successful career in your life right make a note of that now coming to my fourth uh, you know area which is money you look at that there's a you know a, a pile of money here yeah, that's again in dollars that's okay the idea is to you know just visualize and see yourself like you have so much of money in your life right now look at the affirmations that i have now that says you know 
thank you universe for all the money i have in my life so i'm like thank you universe for whatever i have in my life and i'm also mentioning you know i'm having great savings and i'm financially free and that's one of my affirmation and i also mention you know i love making money and adding value for making money. you you see that there and you know i have also mentioned my income is more than double compared to my expenses right now that's again an affirmation right and look at those two boxes another these are again two principles to have a successful money standard in your life it is you know i have more than 10 sources of income see if you want to become rich right just one source of income won't help or two sources of income won't help you need to have multiple you know sources of income to become rich right that's one and i also mentioned that i am a master at making money easily now that's one of my you know the principle that i work when it comes to money standards cool now how many of you do like to see what i have in terms of my money what are my visions in terms of money and how i how i would like to attract them and what are my ideology behind you know attracting money right cool so here's the thing all right you see this on the left there's a magnet which is attracting money which means i am a money magnet and here i have just mentioned you no know, money simply loves me my money flows to me easily and you know i attract unlimited money making opportunities right now these are the things that i want to have subconsciously printed here in my mind right and just look at this i am a money magnet i own a bmw 6 now this is my next car that i would like to buy and i'm pretty sure i'm going to hit that target very soon so a nice black color bmw 6 that's my next car and you know i have mentioned i have more than 30% i have i have saved more than 30% of my income consistently i am financially free i enjoy shopping i go on luxurious holidays with my family i receive money i am grateful to money and do you see the picture on the right here this one is the dream house that i really want to you know buy that's my dream house and again see there i have mentioned i have a very luxurious villa fully owned by us which is 100% was to approve right remember i was telling now vastu approved is something you cannot have vastu compliance is something you cannot have a picture of it right but putting it in the form of affirmations makes your job easy that's what i have put here and in the bottom line i mentioned thank you money for loving me and being there with me always right so i'm kind of thanking money so every the morning i get up i just read these things i'm thankful and grateful to that now i'll show you one last thing this is very close to me while i was creating it and it is career specific vision board all right this you see this look at that i have mentioned 5 lakh rupees profit every single month consistently right and i have mentioned you know there's 100% show up and 50% conversions on the zoom webinars that i'm doing you see my picture there with the zoom this thing and i'm training more than 1000 students on zoom i have 50 plus paid students every month now that's my you know uh, target as of now which is going to you know you know a spike up later after i finish this i'm going to upgrade my vision board and you see there's a picture of my book with the amazon best selling badge there where i also mentioned uh, as an affirmation that i have sold more than 100000 copies and my book has become international best seller right now this is interesting you see this this picture now thanks to my wife because this picture about tedx because i want to go on tedx now that's one of my visions that's one of my goal in my life and i want to feature myself on tech talks and you know josh talks as the platforms you see the best part here the picture was of a different person but thanks to my wife she was able to you know replace his face with my face right now that's being a little creative there thanks to my wife she's a uh, artist i would say you know doing these things thanks to her and you know look at the affirmations there i have mentioned you know i have 100000 plus subscribers on youtube but see i can say 100000 plus this is going to be one year's kind of a target for me after next year i'm going to you know improvise this or i'm going to you know upgrade the numbers so that's the way how you upgrade your vision board as well right and i also mentioned i have a blue tick on my facebook and instagram my website is launched and available on podcast also so these are my visions and i have put in you know, a nice you know uh, cuts of the youtube silver button and the uh, you know blue tick marks on facebook and instagram and importantly i mentioned my investments are growing exponentially and which are giving me more than 100% returns right so see this is my vision board when i created the vision board you know it was not just like created for the heck of creating it i have spent close to 4 hours choosing the pictures that i wanted to choose you know having right affirmations in the vision board i just try to make it as personal as personal as possible i wanted to do it and that's how i how i created these vision boards and these vision boards are 
next to my wall the moment i wake up in the morning i look at them so this was my vision board and it is right next to the wall of my you know bedside so the first thing i get up in the morning i get up to see those pictures and before i sleep i look at these pictures and I sleep peacefully so that's the first thing and the last thing i do every single day and do you see how effortless it has become just pasting on the wall you wake up in the morning and you look at that all right so did you like my vision board do you think this is an effective way of having a vision board clubbing with affirmations if your answer is yes do hit the like button and subscribe to my channel to never miss any value packed videos every time i upload it and of course hit that bell icon to you know get notified every time when i upload a new video with this we come to an end of today's topic but before i leave i want to tell some of you this tell me how many of you are not very comfortable having a vision board in your house or on the walls how many of you don't really want others to know about your big goals and you feel a little shy about it if you have any of these thoughts in your mind i can only tell you one thing my friend if you're feeling shy with your own dreams if you're not comfortable with your own dreams and goals even the universe won't be very comfortable to help you attract your dream life what will happen the most tell me people will look at it first maybe they will even judge you at times maybe they'll judge you in that moment after that they will get used to that and they will forget it trust me that's happened but when you achieve your dream life your visioned life they will be the first ones to come and ask you for the secret of your success see i don't feel shy sharing my visions with you or who sees my vision board that's why i showed my you know my personal goals with everybody i put it on the youtube also right? and i'm confident that i'm going to attract these goals in my life very soon so don't let others become a resistance between you and your dreams all right i hope i was able to add value in your law of attraction journey with the help of this video if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get notified every time i upload a new value packed video all right so i'll see you in the next video this is vibhav chinchure signing off peace out